today and I just want to say that I'm so proud of my mother for throwing this for throwing this event today. And I hope you guys continue to work with her. Continue <laughs> to, to work with her. And if you if some of you guys on there will uh, are here, I hope you enjoy the party. Ray, how did you get all these people here at the Microsoft office in Lenox Mall? Girl, how did you do that? Well, what I say to everybody is it's only together that we can do what we can never do alone. And so I appreciate you introducing the AIBs, which is the acronym for Authors in Business, and we move as one, and we believe that we leave no author left behind. So what you have a pleasure to witness and see behind of us is a group of authors who are moving as one to help each other to impact the lives of people nationwide. And so I'm so excited to be here to be able to open up my resources to them in order to impact the lives of others. So thank you again, Dr. Walter, for allowing me to uh, share this with your audience too as well, and also to highlight the um, future authors um, to your audience as well. So thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. Hey Amen. One more time, we love you, Desiree. Y'all can do better than that. One more time, we love you, Desiree. We love you, Desiree. Let me hear y'all say woohoo! Woo hey everybody, I'm Tanya Porterman, author of the X Con Factor. You did your time now, what? Journey from DLC to CEO. I want to let you know that if you change your mindset, young teens, domestic violence survivors, and even some of you HR professionals and employers, y'all need to get this book. This is for re entry, people that are re entering back into this book bless me it's a game changer it's a mindset shift it's for anybody who is ready to make some changes in their life you can get this book on amazon.com check look up tiny quarterman dr sims helped me write this he he wrote the foreword for this book for me and i'm just so grateful to him for helping me out pushing me to get this book done because now it's ready for you hey man so what's next for you tonya What's next? It's a whole bunch more coming. And there's in the back of this book, it tells you what I got coming soon. So you got to get the book to find out. Oh, that is, I'm so proud. Introduce you. yourself and give us the title of your book. Okay, my name is Kalila Wilborn, and my book is Uber, Your Vehicle to Wealth. And it's all about creating wealth through entrepreneurship. Um, my company is MillionDollarMommy.tv, and what we do is we help single moms create wealth through entrepreneurship. Oh, that is awesome. So talk a little bit about your book. Okay, so the book, it came about because I um, started driving for Uber. Oh, in, okay. Uh, spare time. Uh -huh, right. About a, a little over a year ago. And I said, it's such a great opportunity, um, you know, for people to earn extra income, to right. supplement their incomes, because a lot of people are living paycheck to paycheck. That's right. And I'm like, you know what, this is such a great opportunity for people to hop, to get into, and, um, you know, just to be able to create some additional income for the household. And then, say for instance, if you have a business that you want to launch, um, then it's an opportunity to use that money that you make from there and pour it into the business that you really want to do. Oh, that is awesome. How do people get in touch with you? Well, you can get in touch with me on um, social media. Just go to um, uberwealthnow.com and that'll just connect you to my Facebook page and you can um, stay in contact with me there. All the right, book thank you. on Amazon. Um, it's called Uber, Your Vehicle to Wealth. And you can just go to bit.ly forward slash Uber Wealth now. Oh, that is also good to see you. All right, thank you. <laughs> and we're going to start with the Viking and then you. Y'all kind of talk about you, introduce yourself and talk about your book a little bit. Okay, so I'm Melissa Root and my book is Choose Your Viking. It's part of a series called My Viking is Not Your Prince Jeremy. And it's really about uh, thinking about what we're looking for in our future spouse and changing our thought process to look for a Viking who's going to join us in battle of life rather than a Prince Charles who's going to whisk us away and take us away from all of our problems. Oh, that is awesome. And I am Samira Falame, and I wrote How to Transform Wounds to Wisdom and Create a New Life. And I'm a breast cancer survivor. So Amen. Thank you very much. And so I wrote this book based on the hero's journey, uh, showing people how to basically have a roadmap for um, moving through whatever transformation that they may be going through. Oh, that's awesome. Yes, we're all the heroes in our own lives. and But if we don't realize that, we don't recognize that, that what we're going through all the time is sacred 
and that you are the hero, and uh, that there are markers already out there. Everybody's gone through this journey from the beginning of time. It's not new. It's nothing new, is it? It's not new. Oh, that is all. Well, proud of you, ladies. Thank you. All right, keep up the good work. Thank you. All right. Hey guys, I'm Mark the Pro Jackson, Mark A. Jackson out of North Carolina, and I am the author, self-published author of my new book, Keeping It Super Simple, In Network Marketing, What You're Not Taught From Stage. All that is awesome. And I am Deborah D. Jones. I'm the author of How to Pray When You Don't Have Time. Oh, you better say that. So why should somebody read either one of your books? Well, I'm going to tell you why you should read mine. They should read mine because if they are living a busy life, if you have things to do in your life and you feel like you're running out of time, you need to pray. If you think you don't have time, you need to pray. All right. This book will help you with some of those clues on how you can pray in a short period of time and see actual results. Oh, that's, that's good. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, well, the reason why you need to read this book is because I teach you how to keep it super simple in network marketing. Well over 95% of everybody in the industry, no matter what company you're in, is making less than $500 a month residually, and there's a reason why. What you're not taught from stage. So I teach you the tangibles, but more importantly, the intangibles that you need to generate ongoing residual income. Oh, that is good stuff. Thanks, guys. All right, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. All right, all right, here we go. All right, we'll start with Myra, Lisa, and Rod. Y'all introduce you and your book. Okay. This is All right, that's good. Good job. Good job. I want to read that. <laughs> <laughs> I've dealt with that before. I, I want to read it. My name is Lisa, and I am the author of The Cuts Don't Hurt Me More from Abuse to Abundance. And I share with, um, bring hope to others that no matter how far you hit rock bottom, there's hope in rising to the top. Oh, that's and good. Just being able to um, allow yourself to. Allow yourself to um, find that find happiness in your journey, no matter where you, where you are in your journey. Find happiness in it. So, That's good. That's it. Yeah. Hi, Rob. Hi, I'm Rob Gegner. I live in Houston, Texas, and uh, I wrote a children's book called Artie's Art House. It's about doing okay. what you love, about a little kid who loves to paint. Uh, it's a very simple story, uh, and I also wrote a collection of short stories called Non-Perfect and other short stories. Um, it's pretty much like a really honest look at it. There's a stream of consciousness um, story. There's a, a story about two people of different, two, two women of different age groups who meet um, on a social media app. Um, so it ranges from like lighthearted and like, uh, and um, uh, giving you warm feelings to kind of like a dark satire of society. Okay, that's good. That's, I am so proud of y'all. Give each other a high five. Give all three of you give each other a high five. Woohoo! Facebook, and I just wrote my first book, Butterflies in My Stomach. Make peace with the butterflies because the fear may never go away. I wrote this book because I live a lifetime in fear. And if I was waiting for fear to ever go away, I would have never done what I was supposed to oh, do. Oh, wow. So I wrote this book for you, those of you who are gripped with fear. Don't wait for it to go away, baby. Just do that thing. Butterflies in my stomach. All right, thank you. <laughs> How you doing? I'm Rick Strickland, the author of The March Left Behind. I'm here to I'm here to present my book at the book signing. Hopefully, I get a chance to meet you. An opportunity to talk about my book a little bit more, let you know what Black History is all about. My book is filled with a lot of short stories, a lot of powerful impact that's going to have on the community. So thanks for the time. Hope to see you soon. Oh, that's good. How can we get the book, man? You can get my book by going to. Byrixbook.com. Oh, that's good stuff. Thank you.